What's good, everyone? Welcome in. Appreciate you guys stopping by today. <laughs> Season three, it's time to open up. We got a big one. Um, I mean, I'm telling you, this is gonna be insane. Uh, just because in season three we got ourselves some players out here now. Uh, Nebraska's loaded. Creighton's here. There it is. Roby's gonna move into the center spot. O'Neal back to the power forward. Mobley, newcomer Theo Navarre, and Anton Gill. So to the bench goes Palmer Jr. So we're gonna try to run this thing up and down the court. We'll see how it goes. Man, this is the first time you've ever been here. Uh, make sure you hit that follow button on Twitch, and if you're on YouTube, uh, subscribe to the channel, man. I'm putting out stuff almost every single day. Right now, we're kind of in this NCAA basketball thing going, but we'll we'll switch it up and probably. I'm thinking maybe Nebraska some starts NHL, the in the 12th some spot. hockey. You have to look at this team and see potential. It's go. crucial that they get off to a good start this season if they want to push themselves into the Number nation's elite. Number 12 in the country to start the year. Well, and there we go. The starting lineups for each team. Great. I'm going to keep my eyes on the two kids at the small forward position. Nebraska, when you talk about two seniors, seniors these guys are definitely uh, at the top of the list for their respective We uh, don't have a lot of... We have a couple manage or not, a couple of uh, upperclassmen, but a lot of youth on this team. Ladies and gentlemen, boys <laughs> and girls, here we go. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Just gonna miss the tip. Looks like a full court man to man press, Mr. Vitale. We're gonna move it around the perimeter. So good. Led Nebraska with 27 points last year. We're gonna play. Great, no good. Jump on the goal. Push down the goal. Neil has so hair. So important now at the point. The point guard will set things up and the other four will go to work. Well, you know what they're doing is a four around the with a post guy on the interior. And they're trying to get that ball to the inside. The but they play with four Brass. people on the exterior. Neil for three. He tips the three. No good. Off the mark. The point guard receives the ball. Both so teams are to get something First going. start at Nebraska. From the corner. Three in the way. Got it. The J. Is that Foster? Great one for her. Seems over. just as skilled scoring as he does distributing the ball. I tell you, Brad, passive scorer types are very difficult to guard. Go looking for three again. Can't get to go. Creighton controls the board. Here it comes back to Jay. Right at him. Couldn't get to go. Off the glass and no good. They strip him in a basketball. Got a little too fancy. Too much mustard there, baby. I want to thank you for joining us tonight with Dick Vitale and Aaron Andrews. I'm Brad Nessler. Can't connect. Up, up, and away. Slam, jam, bam. What muscle he's got, baby. On the outside. Controlling the ball. Trying to feed the low block. Block shot usually creates shot. momentum and opportunity. That one went through the high post, Dick. You know, whether you're attacking the zone or man to man, Freedom you the ball pressure the knocks it down. On he team. makes his first shot as Oscar. It's seven to three. Here they come now with full court pressing defense. This may be a great opportunity for them to break the press and get some easy baskets for that. In the lane, missed uh, it. You got to put back up and can't get it to go. First that foul's going to be on both group. Well, I don't know if there's such a thing as a good foul, but that might have been one right there, Dick. Hey, Mr. Nestle, I like that type of play. He's saying to the defense, no so easy pass. Nebraska rated 12 to start the game. Open up against Creighton. Right Creighton has proved one thing. They're not afraid of Nebraska. Pushes it up. Oh, 
Left it for three. All good. Turn over by the senior. Bar trying to get oh, himself a call there. That that call. Call. Well, it's a silly foul it's right there, but look at his face. His facial expression tells it all. Foul charge. It's a foul on Mobley. This is his second. He's going to go to the bench. So the dynamic well, sophomore runs into some issues. Foul. Well, that's a smart play, Brad. In comes Reynolds. I like his mentality. Had red hair no, last year. He's got pass. blonde this year. Here's another <laughs> solid junior. Day. You know, Brad, you look at your juniors. Swear, it's the first shot up. Nothing, there. Nothing should be new to them by the time they're in the third season. Nebraska, the problem, they Nebraska, know what's so much expected talent. of them in the classroom. You don't they should know what to expect in the conference of you know, The level of familiarity shot. should be much higher than what it was in their first year. Also, another turnover, turnover by Nebraska. Nebraska's bigs are having tough trouble today. The small forward on the right side. For two. Oh, shot. Off man. the glass no and no good. They're both Reynolds. To the bar. Lost it again. Nebraska. Really the struggling. Takes the pass. Look the basketball. Number 30, right at him. Shot up and, and good. And a foul to go with it, Dick. And just yeah, like that. Awesome, Great. Open up the line. Great. You know, Brad, as a coach, you see there's a very important part of their operation. The underclassmen look up to them and really lean on them for guidance 13, and direction. Three. When a senior accepts this role and leads by example, it helps the coaching staff to the same immensely. And we are struggling, Boston. And a dunk. Really it's 15 to 3. Away, Nebraska's turned it over six times. They need to talk this one over, Brad. Three on the way. Got it. Knocked it down. Reynolds hits the three. It's 15 to 6. Trying to get that ball movement, get that good space. The ball pulls up for three. Rain. Ordeal rebound slams it on. That baby was ugly. A five and run by Nebraska. Dick, you got to be prepared when you go up against this team. They love to pressure in the full court. Hey, you've got that right, Mr. Nestler. They like to get in your face and push you to the turnovers. No good. Oh, he has a rebound. He's going to push it the other way. Look at this big fella on the floor. Go back to Gil. Gil fires. He's typically a good shooter. Yeah, but not tonight. He's got to accept that. That's the pace Nebraska wants to play. Goes up for two. Shot up, guys. Scorches the net with a J. 17 and 9. He says 7. Excellent spacing. That's so important to a good offensive set. It's even more important to have talented guards like they have. Yeah, that helps. Go with the three. Tray. Yes. The J. Nebraska starting to heat up from the outside. 17 to 11 is our score. Dick, you got to be prepared when you go up against this team. They love to pressure in the full court. Hey, you've got that right, Mr. Nestler. They like to get in your face and force you to commit turnovers. Work the perimeter. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. The missed okay. shot. Back and back and back the pass. Transition three. three. No. Off the mark. Foul on the offensive rebound by Epperson. Gillis. Oh, got it. Well, if there is such a thing as a good foul, that was probably it. Sure was, Brad. Nebraska trailing Creighton. 17 to 11. Eight minutes left. The senior Gill goes to the line. Gill goes to the line for the first Push time. Through. It goes in. Second free throw. Got a roll. Oh, he drains it. 17, 13. That's a nylon on NBN. They're working around the perimeter. Three ball. He shoots from outside. Okay. Missed the jumper. Huge rebound. Here comes the bar in transition. Gave it up. He makes a nice shot fake. Let's see if they can get a good shot this trip. They work it back to the outside. They want to open it again. Open three. Mm -hmm. Can't connect. Put in. Tries no. Two. Second. Bucket. Third. Yes. Third opportunity for Nebraska. They got it to go. 17-15. Nebraska starting. Play better. Look to get it to the inside for oh, two. Good. They got Foster it. Wide open on the cut there. 
1915 is our score. Coach looks on. Focus. Is he open man for three? No. Went on the cut. Seven minutes left on the game clock. Why that road? He got to go. 21 15. Rasta pushing him back up the floor. Go down low to the big fella. Finds the open man on the bar. Contested three. It's blocked. Freshman took a bad shot there. I hate to see a young man struggle like this. Both teams looking to get things going here. Goes up with the shot. Missed it. Missed it. Will be a head down here. Number 34 gets the push in basketball. He up face. He pulls up with a jumper. Can't jumper won't go. Gave it up. Far back corner. Nebraska. Nebraska trailing by six. Here is six minutes. Ago. Stolen away. The center gets the pass. That ball's deflected. Really the Blue Jays looking to attack in transition. Down inside. Dumped there by the Creighton Blue run. Jays. High wire rack, baby. 23 to 15 is our score. We're at the six minute mark. Trying to feed inside. I don't to trust Nebraska to shoot it well, but be nice nice get some off the bench, he's got six. That man is doing it all for his team right now. This is a one-man show right now, Brad. This is supposed to be a team Fine game. Fine deal. It's a team but effort. First or second. So right, right now, great. Just really scorching the nets. In comes the big fellow. Ray Ray Crawford, seven foot three, freshman. Nebraska's huge up front. Yes, sir. And zone. Nebraska beat it with the big time three. 25 21 is our score. He deflected. Don't. O'Neill deflected it right to the creek. Blue Jay and he hammers it home. I didn't realize my partner was a high riser. Three on the way. He'd come up short. Tries for two. Got great it. Great shot. The bar couldn't stay in front of him. A nice to job of getting to the hole right there, Dick. Seven That's right. a great job, Brad. Yes. Using his athleticism to get to the hoop and convert. For the, bucket, the big fella. The, the seven foot three. Ray Ray Crawford. It's a little hook shot. Got it to go. Dick, you got to be prepared when you go up against this team. They love to pressure the full court. Hey, you've got that right, Pull Mr. Nestler. They like to get in your face and push you to commit turnovers. Flying down the court. There's a double team waiting there. Great trap. They managed to keep the defender in check. Are you kidding me? He tried to beat it, but he couldn't, Brad. Number 34 gets the pass. About four minutes remaining. He shoots the ball. No. Now with about 10 seconds to shoot. For two, he Tough gets shot. another shot off and in. Hey, this shows you that's the spark, Brad. Thank you. Oh, I hate it. Isolated on the outside. They're working around the arc, looking for the open jumper. Puts it on the floor. Right and up and down. Can't get to the pretty. I can tell you that. That baby was ugly. Hold it in. Let's go for a chance. What do you got for us there? The Cornhuskers. Coach really wants his team to pick up the tempo. He wants his team to get some easier well, baskets, and, and he believes that getting oh, transition baskets back. is the foul. answer. That it sounds as though it's going to have to start with the point guard, though. They'll have to push the ball with the dribble or the pass in order to get things going. So Palmer Jr. Our trusty sideline reporter Aaron Andrews keeping everyone on so their toes there. just trying to figure out rotation. Not the way they want to start the game, obviously. First, First one is good. good. That line is really, really good to him tonight, Dick. Great. That line's Brassen. always good, Brad. These Brassen guys just have to make good use of it. Got them both. He converts on that free throw line, and that's major. Duncan makes his first appearance. I tell you, this youngster can provide a spark on either side of the floor, Brad. Fakes a jumper, kicks it out. They've got a three-point shooter spotting up. Oh, good. Off the mark. Put back. No good. Shots off target. 
Nebraska missing again. It's a 10 point game. Speed. On the outside, he puts Bring up the three ball. Got it. Scorches the net with a J. The big two. fella, right on the floor, Ray Ray Crawford. They work it around the perimeter. Now Here comes O'Neal. Slams it down. Sky with the gigantic dunk. It's a man. Two minutes. You've got to be prepared when you go up against Nebraska this team. They love to punish you in the full court. Hey, you've got that right, Mr. Nestler. They like to get in your face and force you to commit turnovers. Two minutes left on the game clock. Looking for a good shot. Back to Palmer. He tries to take the three. Backs it down. Gets the J to fall. 36 to 30. 154 left here in the half. These two teams just going at it. Momentary. I love shot the blocked shot by Paul. Nebraska. Kill in transition. Lays it up and in. 32 to 36. The Huskers. I'll tell you what. James Palmer Jr. has come in and given Nebraska a little bit of a boost. Coach Mack. It's a tie. Right, right now, both the freshmen. Star Sun, sophomore. Shot on the way. No good. Roby rips down the ball. Here comes back Palmer Jr. On the right side. One more to go for three. Yes, sir. Nebraska's on fire. 36 35. Nebraska's come all the way back. And I tell you what. Now trying to feed the low block. He shoots the jumper. It's been nothing it but down. Palmer Jr. Oh, what a way to run the floor by Roby. And he rips down the rim with a one hand jam. 38 37. With a bucket. Good cut by the Blue Jays. Foster's got 12. 40. They work the perimeter. Palmer Jr. for three. Jumper won't go. Then on the rebound. Kicks it out. Got it to go. He's got six coming off the bench. And we're tied at 40. Looking for a good shot. Well, throw it to him. 12 seconds left in the half. Great to find the something. double team to stop it. Six seconds. Five. Four. Ball screen. Or two. Goes right at him. And he can't pull the rebound in. Yes, it's going to count. That's a great drive to the oh, wow. You know he did a great job I can't the believe it. Floor oh. and getting to the basket. That is on offensive and rebound. The Cornhuskers are trailing by two. In Nebraska. After trailing most of that half by Nebraska 10. The ball it's come all the way back. It's 42 to 40 at so half. These two teams are scorching it. Look at that. You're not going to win many games. Looks like a full court man to man press, Mr. Vitale. Takes it off and turn over my own knee. Here comes back. Got us five assists. Inside. Goes up for two. Tough shot. Good shot. It. Jumping up way from Brody. Gill. Makes the guys come back down. Tries to get the knee to bite. Pressure. Now they work it around the perimeter. Three ball. Yes. Totally found them. Nebraska is scratching over that. Right at him. Plays it in. That's a play. Not a bad basketball team. Oh, what a run the floor by Big O'Neal. Big O'Neal. 
Hatan looks like they want the temple to be at the higher end of the spectrum. This will definitely impact the pace. O'Neal running the floor again. The big fella lays it up and in. Turn oh good function. Nebraska finally has the lead. 47-46. These two teams are just going at it. They've got him right where they want him, Dick. Or two. And the fans are going wide. Oh, the man is on the charge, Brad. Get that sucker out of the game, man. They go into the low block. And he just dumps it on him. Pushes it up. Over for three. Yes, sir. The sophomore hits Nebraska is up 50 to 48. Moving it around the perimeter. Foster for from three. The corner. Can't get to the offense and not put back up. And two. You know what I mean? the bucket to fall. Over for three again. Yes, sir. Back to back. Three to fifty. These two teams just absolutely gone at each other. Working it around the perimeter. Double team now. Bad angle. Jump shot. For three. Yes. I wonder well, if he's ever going to get any help from his teammates. teammates. Dick, he's doing it all and then some. He's obviously carrying his team, Brad. His teammates need to follow his lead and join in on the action. Navarro for three. Bombs no. from outside. Jumper didn't look pretty. I can tell you that. That baby was ugly. Tries for two. Too strong. Nebraska running the other way. Out on the wing. Pump fakes. Oh, the freshman at some of it's a chance. 50 for 53, 9 minutes and 30 seconds left. Both these teams shooting over 50% from the floor. Jump shot. Got it. Jump shot right there. The big fella on the floor. O'Neal. This is insane. How can you not entertain this? Here comes the ball screw. He launches a three. Can't get it. After some rebound. Goes right back up and can't get it to go. Oh, it looked like he had an easy basket coming up, but the defense commits the foul instead. Great play there, Brad. He was able to foul him in order to prevent the easy basket. I think it's important to get to the free throw line, Brad. It demonstrates that you're playing aggressively and that you're not settling for the jump. Uh, see it. Go ahead. Missed it. Uh, he hits a second. Got a second. He went to my crate. Out of bounds. It's not smart to just throw it out of bounds. And that's one too many turnovers. Yeah, those turnovers are really a nightmare, especially when they lead to layups. The center gets the ball. He goes up with it. Oh, and terrible shot short. Bro. The point guard takes the pass. Nine minutes left. 57 56. The chanting continues. Who says there's no such thing as a home court in battle? Oh, good. Here comes back to the field. Way out on top. Controlling the ball. For two. Oh, flies away. the shot. He got it. He's got eight points this half. Deflected out of bounds. The basket lead by three. The largest the in the game is Creighton. Creighton led this by 13. Great team basketball. Nebraska's They're ball was really back. He's taking a nice three. They can't keep this up. Eight thirty-six. Be happy once the final buzzer sounds. He drains the three. The miss shot. Battles out. Here comes back Nebraska. Only pull up. There's the fake. Looking to move it around the perimeter. Killed from deep. Oh, missed it. Yeah. The point guard gets the ball. And we're at the eight minute mark. 
He trains the jumper. He's not getting himself in position for the good shot. Got it to go. A little bit too much. 101. On the outside. Fakes the shot. He shoots with a deep three. Jumper won't go. On the dribble, gives it up. Slowing it down, obviously. Goes up right down. Oh, Can't get to go. That person is going to put it back that ball's block. Did a great job with like that damn, shot. another offensive rebound. That person finishes it with a huge move. It was two in the G. Pushes it up. About seven minutes remaining. Turn over to Nebraska. Yeah, the ball's out of bounds. We'll go back the other way. 60 to 59. Let's take a moment and look at this dunk just one more time. Hey, look at him hammer this one down. Send a message, young man. Send a message. Oh, no, trying to, oh, trying, to trying to get that ball movement, get that good spacing. Dunks him. There he goes. 61 to 60. 10 points in the second half for Mobley. It was scoreless in the first. It was a foul trouble. Now he's exploded. Spacing that's so important to the good offensive Foster. set. It's even more important to have talented guards like they have. Yeah, they're going to more offense than they ran all game. Goes up. Got it. Nails the J. Over that car. He had the ball moving all over the place there, Dick. I tell you, that's a great offensive six execution. Six what a great minutes. job at running their stuff. The ball reversal going to the Can't opposite side. Up. And then they're no, able to convert. To get a call, nothing. Puts oh, up the oh. jumper. No, off no. the mark. The bar the the About push. six minutes remaining in the game clock. The bar's going to pull. Off the mark. The point guard takes the, the pass. There Dunks it. Jam City. Run the floor. The big folks for Nebraska. They get back. Kicks it out. Here's the three ball. Mm -hmm. Missed the jumper. Young guy just can't like continue to pick up fouls. They need him in the game. Well, I don't know if there's such a thing as a good foul, but that might have been one right there, Dick. Oh, hey, Mr. Nessler, I like that type of play. He said to the right. defense, no easy baskets for you. We're going to force you to take nice. shots. Hey, Red, you want to get to the line early and often. You end up getting your opponents into foul trouble, and it's also an opportunity to get some points. Second one the Got it. 65-61. Score. Score. Gave it up. Up fake. Kicks it out. The freshman's a bit careless with uh, the ball. A turnover by the freshman. Great pressure. Great double team. Really explosive. With the J. Nope. The Blue Jays wow. can't afford to have him pick up too many more fouls. And once again, our two featured players here in tonight's Star Watch. Far ahead. What? what? The offensive foul? About five minutes remaining. Come on. With the jump. Oh. Jump it in look pretty. I can tell you that. That baby was ugly. Cross court. Try to come up with a steal, and they do. 440 left. Game has slowed down. Worked the perimeter. Second. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. Arm and foul. Oh, well, it commits foul. an intentional foul there to prevent the easy basket. Well, it's a smart play, Brad, especially if you Everything can afford to use a foster foul. I like his mentality. Oh, no easy basket. Oh. First shot, good. It's take a little bit of a run here in Nebraska to get back in. the dribble gives it up 
There he is, strips the ball loose. I hate that. The passion. Joseph handles the pass. The Blue Jays will probably consider modifying their play style here and go to a more conservative approach. A half-court attack, Dick, especially given the time and score. I think they'll look to settle down. They should be running longer offensive sets, which allows for the ball to move and the clock to wind it up. I'll be surprised if there are any early shots. About four minutes remaining on the game clock. 67, 64, one or four minutes left. Working around the perimeter. Big finish coming here, partner. I'm not going anywhere. Offensively, this is when it's extremely important yeah, to, to have the right Rock people shooting the basketball at moment. the right times. He gives him the fake. Up and inside. Out of bounds and a change of possession. Number 34 with the foul. And well, if there is such a thing as a good foul, that was probably it. Sure was, Brad. He fouled to prevent the easy basket. Okay, we'll go to the free throw line. Which one? Yes. Makes his first. Okay, up by four. So, um, Makes yes. the foul shot. Six they're shooting nine, extremely six, well four. from the strike tonight, Dick. Yeah, they're making their coaches look good for making them shoot extra free throws every day. It's right at him. Tries for two. Can't get it to fall. Rims out. Rebound Creighton. Up five. Three minutes left. For the That's bucket. Not gonna no work. good from the field. The Cornhuskers are on the run. Mobley handles the feed. About three minutes remaining on the game clock. Oh, no. Here they go in transition. For the deuce. He comes up empty. Good defense there by the ball. He Go for the three. They need it. He hit it. Oh, that's a big shot. It's not like this game is the truth, man. Goes up for Ooh, two. Finger roll, got it. 71 67. These in state rivals are going back and forth. Bed the low block. He takes Freshman. the three. Yes. He makes the jump. Lavar hits it. It's 71 70. The freshman with a huge shot. Two eighteen left to go in the game. Number Goes right at O'Neal O'Neal and fouls him. Oh, it looked like he had Probably an easy foul, basket coming up, but the defense easy. commits a foul instead. Great play there, Brad. Swords He's able to foul Caleb him to Joseph. prevent the easy 14 basket. 14 points today. He goes to the free throw line. First one. Yeah. Makes it. They're seeing him all fall from the seven. line tonight. That's a Great. crucial plus down the stretch, Brad. I'm toe to toe. Hits the second. Third. They're nailing the free ones tonight, Mr. Vital. Hey, this is where you win and lose games, Brad. Cross court. Takes Big four turns it over. The point guard handles the pass. The Blue Jays yeah, are in the foul. Wofford's on out. Bodie's back in. Austin Reeves has 20. The Blue Jays are a pretty good free throw shooting First team. Shot. Even over every one of the floor to convert yes. from the line, it makes over. the team very tough, especially down the stretch when the opposition is trying to foul. Good for three. The Ties it up. The oh, baby. Huge shot. 73 to 7. Or 73 all. Excuse me. 146 left. Nebraska Creighton. Creighton pulls out the ball, they're on the set. Spin dribble, goes into the lane, plays it up and in. He got to go. Nebraska like pushes back into the basket. Big fella, sky in the rim, throwing it down. We're tied at 75. 120 left to win the game. Nebraska, Creighton. 
for all of Nebraska. Cross court. One minute left. Jumper. Got it. Plus the J. Bro, is that kind of shoot? We're at the one minute mark. It's a two point game. The fans are going to make it even tougher. Oh, it you didn't expect him to quiet down, did you, Dick? Tries oh, shot. Got it to go. Two home. with a lane. Two huge buckets. That makes it a four point lead. These kids are here to fight, Brad. Goes up with it. Oh, we missed it. Out. Rebound put in. Got it. Plays it up. 79 77. The lead is down to a bucket. Don't need to foul. Hey, this place is about to explode. It's dynamite, baby. Turnover. Here we go. No place, man. Absolute stud in the second half. Good. Wide open for three. No good. 35 seconds left. Nebraska does not. Shot clock, eight o'clock mark, pretty much. He's Three on the way. Oh my goodness, what a dagger. Holy Max. They cut the lead to two. Hold on to your seat, Mr. Nestler. Hard foul on the play there. 82 to 80. Reeves goes on the line. 20. And Got this one. First one up. He Got makes it. the front end of the one and one. Second one. Gets Got the it. second. All you need is a score and a stop to have a chance. He oh, dunks on you. That makes it a two-point oh. game, Dick. And the palms are starting to sweat, believe me. 8.5 left. Mosley yeah, picks up his fourth. Epperson goes to the line. The Got to miss one. One and one. First one up. Yes. Second shot. Oh, he missed it. Nebraska down three. Isolated on the outside. Corner three. Oh, he missed it. O'Neal hits it, but it was too late. Does it count? Oh my god. Nebraska can't pull this one out. Very good game. This is the type of game that the coaching oh, staff will be studying no. for weeks to come. So for Dick Vitale and Aaron Andrews, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long. It was after the buzzer. It wouldn't have mattered. It wasn't a three. Creighton comes into Nebraska and shocks the Oscars. 85 to 82. What a finish. Let's take a look at the stats. Post-game stats. The Brass players players of the game players for this one. Here they are. Get that W, 25 baby. points, Get nine that assists. W, and that's what it's all about. Shot had seven threes. Seven to 14 from the three-point line. Overall, Nebraska, 14 for O'Neal, 12 for Mobley. All in the second half. Navar with eight as a freshman. Gill with 25. Miles didn't even play. Crawford with four. Reynolds with six and four assists. We gotta figure out our lineup better. Man, that's disappointing. But it is what it is. Let's see here. We'll advance to the next game. I think we got some recruiting we can do, maybe. I think we go we go to Maui next. So the Maui Invitational. It's number three Ole Miss. Cancel that. We don't want to go too far ahead. Gotta go right to here. No. And that stinks because we had a facility upgrade we know what we got. Dang. We'll send to this day. So Nebraska loses their opener 82 to 85. Hmm. Great. They're going to be 
a problem in the Missouri Valley. So we'll head in and see what we got as far as recruiting. Targets. So we'll take a look at this. All right, Tuesday, that's what it is. It goes to Tuesday. So we're heading to Maui. We play number three, Ole Miss. Back at it, bro. Look at that. Do you see this? Look at this game. Creighton beat me 82 to 85. Ugh. Not the start we wanted. This guy he is not very good. How about him? What do we got? Uh, some details here. 25, 16. I like that. 6, 11. I'm a little off on the scholarship. We'll see what happens. McDonald's all American. Can we offer this cat? What's he? He shoots on 32% from the three. Does not share the basketball well. We'll offer him a scholarship. And we'll give him a phone call. We need point guards. Because we're on loose ours. Wolverton cat. How good is he? Indiana. 42% from three. Only averages 10.7 points a game. Hmm. Must be on a loaded team or something. Talk about the strategy, and we will offer a scholarship. three-point shooter. All right, let's go take a look at some of these. Vic Hudson, Florida. Bill Blake, how good is he? Only a 30% three-point three shooter. I'm looking for dudes that can light it up. Dave Walsh, the number one player in the country. 33% from three? Still not, that doesn't fit my offense, man. Hey, we're moving up on this cat. Tim Whitehead. 
52% from three. This is my dude right here. Head coach is going to visit. We're talking about bags of money. Playing time as a freshman. How about that? Uh, why not? We'll offer this guy a scholarship. Let's come in hard. Let's see if we can. Dude, imagine if I would have went to Kentucky. Ugh. The dudes that I would have had. I couldn't even think about that right now. This guy's not bad either. I want one guy. Who knows what happens? All right, so we're heading to Maui. It's not going to get any easier. The Maui Classic. Oh. Some of these dudes? Is Ole Miss not as good as I thought? Ole Miss comes in number 13. We're unranked. Man, we better fit it for what dudes. Creighton's legit, by the way. They're going to be a problem. Alright, so let's take a look at the bracket. So the preseason bracket, they're in Arizona, Virginia, already beat Michigan State. What was the score of that one? 71 59. Michigan State's replacing a lot of dudes. Villanova beat Sean Mott. 103 to 75. Nice. Oh, Nebraska Ole Miss. Should be fun. Oh. All right. Let's take a look at the polls real quick before we jump off. Actually, what a character. Failed to get that. So what's this one say? Pumped for a national televised game. All right, we need to upgrade our facilities. That's for sure. Latest we slipped a little bit. Where we fall? Louisville's already four and up. Good God. Clemson, when they were preseason number one, the defending national champion has fallen to number ten. Wisconsin 3 0, Kansas down, Nebraska. We lost and fell out of the media poll. And the coaches poll, we are not rated either. So that lost to Creighton did us no favors. Alright, well, it's early, plenty of time. Recruiting wise, though, I ain't about. I mean, I know you can do some shitty stuff, so we'll see if we can do something like that this year and move on. All right, that's gonna be it for us today. Hey, appreciate you guys stopping by. If you have not subscribed to the channel, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Also, uh, follow us on Twitch, man. We're uh, putting out content all the time. Might throw in a hockey game later today. I don't know. Uh, anyways, thanks for stopping by. Some of us.